Good morning. Doing a uh, an unboxing. I know I look a little low because I'm sitting on one of them beach chairs and I'm using <laughs> my work table that I make uh, my rustic flags on. So it looks weird because this is I look really low, but who cares? Um, I'm unboxing the the Cotopaxi Torre T O R R E um, 24 liter. This is my first. I don't see very many unboxing videos of this particular uh, travel pack on anywhere, anywhere. I only seen one maybe on TikTok, not even a review or an unboxing, but um, this is the first one we're doing. So this is the uh, Cotopaxi tw uh, 24 liter Torre, T-O-R-R-E. This is, you can see it brand new, it's still sealed. So I'm gonna, you're gonna get first reaction. Gotta be careful, yeah, I know. Even a razor blade is being careful with it. Let's see. I'll turn it sideways so you can see I'm not covering it up. Oh wow. This is not it's a small box too. The box isn't big. If you see, the box isn't big at all. The box is small, so the bag is small. So there it is right there. I'll turn it around so you can see it. That's the bag and it's plastic. It comes with um, that gear for good about the Cotopaxi story, which is amazing. They're an amazing company. Oh, wow. Let's take a look. It goes one card and this card is, it says this message. You can see her, maybe a picture of her. And then there's a message in the back. So this says, it says this message was handwritten for you by a member of the refugee community in Salt Lake City, Utah. Wow. It says, do good and adventure on in the writer's native language. Cotopaxi partners with the International Rescue Committee to facilitate this card, <laughs> card writing program, which serves as an employment opportunity for refugees living in Utah. Wow, I was in Utah a couple of weeks back. And uh, wow, that's amazing. I went to one of their stores out in Salt Lake City and um, I didn't know this while, so I'll show it closely. That's her handwriting. Wow, I'm gonna keep this. That's that's a nice touch. So I'm gonna un take the bag off of it. This is like a green, like a, I hope the lighting is okay. But this is like a, like a, I forgot what color this is. Like, they call it spruce. So this is a spruce color. I hope I don't get any spray paint on it because there's spray paint on here. But this is the bag. It's like a green. It comes with these great colors. Like blue, little, like where you put your D-rings on. Oh, I forgot what they call those. Um, there's a bunch of these on the outside. There's a water bottle holder. And I'm going to undo the bag so you can see it. But great colors. Great colorways there. Light blue. Everything says coat epoxy on it with these little... D ring holders, there's a handle here. Um, there's water bottle holders on both sides, actually, they're very stretchy. This is a beautiful bag. And the front and top is made out of that plastic coated kind of um, that nylon, that plastic coated nylon. And then there's a coat epoxy, this is like a material label right here. This is nice. I'm gonna open it up and see what it's like. Let's see. I gotta undo the strap first in order to get the bag to open up completely. So it has two, you can't hide these away, but this is your uh, shoulder straps. They're adjustable with a chest strap right there. These are adjustable. And it has a small little waist, um, like a waist belt. You can't hide these away. I Let me see something. Yeah, no, you can't. You can't hide them away, but it's okay. And also it has this back padded, it's padded, which it seems like what some might be breathable. Back pad. It's a very simple bag, which is really nice. So the top, I'm going to open this up first. The top has, it looks like two zippers, one here and one for the main compartment. So let's open the small one first and see what that's like. So the small one, when you open it, it's just the top of the bag. Like if I stood the bag up like this, stand it up like that. It's a little zipper that goes into the top. It's not that big, it just covers the top of the bag. So you could put like your stuff in there, 
whatever like you need to get to right away if you're traveling, wallet, glasses, shades, phone, whatever, that goes on top. And there's a, it's like a lighter color in the inside if you can see it, which is nice because that creates contrast. Oh, and there's a little clip so you can put your keys, put it right in there. So that's pretty cool. Um, the main compartment, which is this zipper right here, the same like a light green color, which is really nice. Ooh. And there's another zipper, I hope you can see it without making too much craziness. There's another zipper on the lid. So if you look at the lid, like that, I think I'm getting spray paint on it. Whatever, I'll make it quick then. There's another zipper on the lid, and it's fleece lined. Maybe you can put your shades in there. So, that and they have these good zipper pulls everywhere. There's great zippers. Um, oh, there's another zipper right on the front of the bag. So, if you look, there's another zipper right here. So, if you pull that one, that one goes, that one's not that deep. You can see it stops like right here. So when I put my hand in this one, it stops right here. So it's another little pouch for whatever you want to put in it. Whatever you need to put in there, smaller stuff. So it only goes about that far down. The inside, if you can see, that's the inside, it's like a lighter color. So you can see things, I guess. There's a, uh, what looks like a laptop pouch right in here. You put a laptop maybe I don't know, maybe like a 13, 15 inch or more. I don't know, I don't have my laptop with me. Probably behind me, but you can put that in there. It's padded, so it'll protect it, and it stretches. There's these little stretchy bands on the outside of it. So just hold your laptop, strap it in. There's another little pouch right here, right on top of the laptop uh, holder, that you could put more stuff in, maybe a tablet, or whatever the case may be. There's another zipper. to show you but there's another zipper right there in the inside and you can put more stuff in there as well and this is a nice bag it's perfect for traveling I guess or whatever you have to do for going to school and in the main compartment it's pretty big the main compartment goes all the way to the bottom of the bag look it goes to the bottom of the bag so it's really nice um, I noticed this too on the outside you can cinch it there's little cinch um, straps to make the bag a little bit smaller if you have to cinch it tight. You see them on the sides there. Yeah, see, for the bag, there's four of them actually. One, two, three, four, so you can cinch the bag down. It's a great bag. This is perfect for getting up and going. If you need to go somewhere, do some stuff, do some traveling, but this is the one you can take with you, I guess, on a plane and keep it by your feet with all your necessities in there that you need right away. Great bag. Well made too, well made. Hoping, like I said before, I'm not getting spray paint all over it, and I am, man. But, yep, that's the, I'm getting spray paint all over so I'm gonna cut this short. Um, yeah, but that's the Torre 24 liter bucket pack, they call it. It's uh, the Cada Dia model. It's in spruce color from Cotton Paxi. It's a great bag. This bag is a good get up and go bag. You know, or like I said before, put it at your feet in the plane. It looks like it'll fit perfectly right underneath the seat in front of you, depending on your airline, I guess. And um, you can do a whole lot with this bag. You can do a whole lot with it. Great carry handles, a lot of storage, great stretchy water bottle compartments, cinch. You can hang stuff from it. This is great. This is a great bag. This is the first unboxing and review. I'm no professional, but I figured I'd do this so somebody else can see the bag because I know I hadn't been able to find one. So again, zipper pocket in the front, zipper pocket on the top so you can access your stuff. Main compartment, zipper. There's a laptop compartment on the inside. Another little, another little place right here so you can put maybe something else. Tablet, there's another, there's another pocket in the inside. I'm just trying to do a quick overview. And um, it's not a heavy bag. It's not a heavy bag at all. It's a great looking bag. Get and go, get up and go type bag. Another great one by uh, Kodopaxi, the 
Tory 24 liter bucket pack in spruce. There you go. Hope you uh, like this review. And there's all dark blue in the back. <laughs> this is a great bag. Great bag, and I'm, I'm getting spray paint over it, so I'm gonna stop. All right, uh, thank you guys, appreciate it, and I uh, hope you like the review. Thank you.